la 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 à ma maman joyeux noël oh uh, hello i didn't see you there i was just writing my christmas cards yes i expect you've written yours already let's pop mine in the envelope there we go oh it's joe your french teacher bonjour c'est joe votre professeur de français Lovely to see you again. I hope you've all had a lovely week. I'm getting excited about Christmas. Not long now. Only a few more sleeps. Do you remember how we say Merry Christmas in French? Joyeux Noël. You try. Joyeux Noël. It means Merry Christmas. Joyeux Noël, everybody. <laughs> That's lovely. But before we carry on with... Oh, with learning some French, we need to sing our hello song. Do you remember our bonjour song? So get ready with your waving hands and off we go. Bonjour, bonjour, comment allez-vous? Bonjour, bonjour, très bien, merci beaucoup. Bonjour, bonjour, je suis content d'être ici. Bonjour, bonjour, avec tous mes amis. Bonjour Joe, bonjour les enfants. Lovely, well done. Okay, let's go straight into our Meunier song because you're so good at this one. Ready with your sleepy, sleepy heads. Do you remember our Miller fast asleep? And whilst he's asleep, oh la la, oh la la, le moulin tourne très vite et très fort, <laughs> juste comme ça. Okay, are we ready? Let's put the music on. Ready? Tout le monde dort. Meunier, tu dors, ton moulin va trop vite. Meunier, tu dors, ton moulin va trop fort. Ton moulin, ton moulin va trop vite, ton moulin, ton moulin va trop fort. Ton moulin, ton moulin va trop vite, ton moulin, ton moulin va trop fort. practicing that one. <laughs> Very good. Okay, I think we're ready for our numbers. Have you got your wiggly fingers? Show me your wiggly fingers. Oh, bravo. How many wiggly fingers do we have? Hmm. Je pense que j'ai dix. J'ai dix. Do you remember? Ten is dix. Very good. Okay, off we go. Un, deux, trois. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, six, quatre, cinq, six, sept, huit, sept, huit, neuf et dix, neuf et dix. <laughs> Very good. Bravo. Give yourself a big clap. Bravo, bravo. Now, last week, we counted on a bit more than up to 10, didn't we? Do you remember how far we counted? Can anyone put their hand up and tell the teacher how many fingers we counted? Do you remember we used our bongo song? That's right, we pretended we had some drums and we're going to And do you remember we lifted our arm up and we went all the way up? Deset, deset. That's right, we went up to 20. 20 is number 20. Very good. Okay, are we are going to do the song now. So get your bongos ready. And remember it goes 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. And then we lift our arm up. We go 17. And then in a low voice, 17. 18. 18. 19. Is enough. And then we do a big explosion. Vin. Vin. Very good. Okay, let's do it with the music. 
off we go. Get those bongos ready. cette chanson. I love that song. Do you? Good. Okay, so we're moving on from our counting and I think it's time we looked inside our magic box today. We haven't, we didn't do it last week because we ran out of time, but this week I'm going to do it first. So first of all, you need to have um, either a box near you or maybe you could use the floor and we're going to knock. Remember? And when we knock on the box, we need to say tock, tock, tock. Can you say it? Tock, tock, tock. And then we go like this. Kiela. Kiela means who's there? Kiela. Right, well done. So what did we find in our box before? I think there were some woodland animals. We had un sanglier, a wild boar, an ours, a bear. Uh, did we have an elephant? An elephant. I like the elephant avec la trompe. An elephant. And maybe un cerf. Do you remember our reindeer? Or our deer? Un cerf. Let's see who's in this box this time. So remember, you've knocked on the door and we've said qui est là. I'm going to open it up. Un, deux, trois. <gasps> oh. oh la la. Il est grand. He's very big. Il est très grand. Il est tout blanc. He's all white. Tout blanc. What kind of animal this could be? Il a des dents pointues. <sighs> it sounds a bit scary. Il mange les phoques, les oiseaux, les œufs et les algues. He eats all sorts of things. He eats seals. Ooh. He eats birds. Ooh. Eggs. Oh. And seaweed. Les algues. Okay. So he might live by the sea. Il peut courir très vite. He can run very fast. Mm. And where does he live, I wonder? Il vit au pôle nord. On the North Pole like Father Christmas. I think you're ready to find out who he is. I bet you've guessed already. So I'm going to open up and show you. Allez, vous êtes prêts? Are you ready? Here he comes. He's all white. He's a bit fierce. And he's a carnivore. Look, did you guess right? Did you guess? That's right. C'est un ours polaire. We've had our bear before, haven't we? But he wasn't a polar bear. This is an ours, just like the bear, polaire, because he lives in the in North Pole. L'ours polaire. Bonjour, l'ours polaire. Bonjour, je suis féroce. Ooh, he's a bit scary and ferocious, but he looks very beautiful. <laughs> That's our winter animal. L'ours polaire. 
Au revoir, ours polaire. Very good. Good guesswork there. Okay, put him back in the box and we'll see who we find next time when we open our box. A different animal entirely. Okay, excellent. I think it's time for another song. So, do you remember last week we did a very Christmassy song with some bells? Now, if you don't have bells, you can use your shakers. Our shakers are good. And it's our song all about the winter wind. The winter wind. Le vent. Vive le vent. Vive le vent is the French song for jingle bells. So, you can use your bells or you can use your shakers. But this time, instead of doing uh, the song all the way through, we're going to do musical statues. So, you can shake your shakers, but when the music stops, remember to freeze. Like the snowman, comme le bonhomme de neige. Okay, so listen very carefully. Carefully, when you hear the music stop, nobody move. We'll see who is the best at being a statue. Okay, let's find the song. It's called Vive le Vent, and it's really good. So remember at the beginning, the winter wind, going through the trees, give a little shake. shakers back and you can give yourself a big clap. Bravo tout le monde. I love that song. Vive le vent. Just like jingle bells. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. You know that one, don't you? Brilliant. Okay, we've done our vive le vent song. And I think 
it's time to look inside our magic bag because we need to see who's in there today. That's right, we've got our magic bag. And I think, oh, it's quite heavy. Must be one of our heavier friends. Let's have a look. Cuckoo, Kiela, Kiela. Oh, I think, oh, here he comes. Oh, bonjour, Oscar. C'est Oscar le chien. Bonjour, Oscar. Oh, bonjour, Oscar. Comment ça va? You look like you've been rushing around. Oh, oui. Il y a beaucoup de choses à faire pour Noël. That's right. There's so many things to do for Christmas. Oh, and look. Oh, it's, it's my dog come to say hello too. Now, Oscar, qu'est-ce qu'il y a dans ton sac? Oh, dans mon sac, il y a beaucoup de choses. Il y a même un cadeau pour toi. There's a, there's a present for me. Fantastic. Let's have a look. Oh, Oscar, merci. You bought me a beautiful hat. Oh, you wear it, Oscar. Oh, there we go. Oh, uh, 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 je peux pas voir. Oh dear, it might be a bit big for him. What do you think? Oscar, qu'est-ce qu'il y a? Oh, you've lost his head. There we go, <laughs> that's better. You can see more. J'adore ton chapeau de Noël. I love your Christmas hat. It's beautiful. Well, if you've even got my dog over there. <laughs> Excellent, I think she wants one too. This is Roxy, everyone. Can you see her? Can you see Roxy? Say hello. Bonjour. <laughs> she loves Ox Oscar too, don't you? I don't know. Okay. Hopefully she'll be quiet whilst we do some French together. She always likes to get involved though. Hello, Oscar, qui est dans ton sac? Oh, oh oui, il y a un cadeau pour moi. There's a present for me too. Ah, oh, so I can feel Christmassy too. Thank you so much. Oh, what do you think? Do you like it? <laughs> it's rather fetching, isn't it? C'est mon chapeau de Noël aussi. So both Oscar and I have got a lovely Christmas hat. Merci. <laughs> but that's not all he's put in his bag for us today. He's got some cards. Are they Christmas cards? Let's have a look. Oscar, you can show me them too. So the first one has a beautiful picture of a candle. Can you see that? Ah oui. Et en français, on dit une bougie. Une bougie is a candle. Une bougie is such a lovely light that we light up. Sometimes we put them in our windows to show people as they go by. Les bougies, but you have to be careful because they have the flame so they can burn. But if we're careful and we put them somewhere we can see them, we can have a lovely candle to light our evenings, the dark winter evenings. So if you can say the word with me, une bougie, une bougie, that's our first Christmas word of the day, une bougie, bravo. What's the next one? Oh, yummy. I love these ones. Oh, moi aussi. Oh, I think Oscar loves these ones. Oh, and I think Roxy likes them too. Right, let's see if we can put Roxy outside. Bear with me. Sorry about that. I had to let my dog out because she loves Oscar so much that she wanted to play with him. There we go. So where were we? That was right. We got to les biscuits. Mmm, yummy Christmas biscuits. Can you see there's a gingerbread man there too? And a candy cane. Des biscuits. You say it. Des biscuits. Bravo. Well done. I think Oscar loves these the most. Les biscuits. <laughs> now, he's got one more card. And can you see what this is? Ah, oh, oui. C'est le sapin de Noël. Isn't it beautiful? Our Christmas tree. Le sapin de Noël. You say it. Sapin de Noël. Very nice. Can you see the one behind me? This is my Christmas tree. I bet you have a lovely Christmas tree in your preschool too, don't you? There we go. Well done, everybody. Now, I think we should probably say au revoir to Oscar because he's, and, and say thank you as well. Thank you for my Christmas hat. And also thank you for showing us your Christmas words. We'll put him back in his bag. So you remember how to say goodbye? 
That's right, we go au revoir, au revoir Oscar, au revoir, au revoir Roxy. <laughs> Bravo, I'm going to put him back in his bag. In he goes, au revoir Oscar, have a lovely Christmas. We can also wish him Merry Christmas. Joyeux Noël, Joyeux Noël, bravo. So that was our magic bag and I really enjoyed that. I love learning new words. Do you remember last week we learnt some new words using our, well, it was their favourite um, cuddly toys. We had this one, le reine, that's right, the reindeer, le reine. We had also, ha oh, ha, le bonhomme de neige, bonhomme de neige, our snowman, and of course, the main man, oh oui, le Père Noël, le Père Noël, that's right, with his capuchon pointu, <laughs> a bit like mine, his pointy hat. Now I think we should do our song about le Père Noël. Do you remember what we had to do, the actions? Remember, we were looking for him. As-tu vu? We were saying, have you seen him? As-tu vu? As-tu vu? Le petit bonhomme, le petit bonhomme, the little man. As-tu vu? As-tu vu? Le petit bonhomme au capuchon pointu. And then we had to pretend. He had a big tummy. On l'appelle... Père Noël. And do you remember how he arrived? That's right, down the chimney. We have to shimmy down the chimney. Par le chimine, par le chimine. And that's right, and we call him Père Noël. Il est entré. Now, the last verse is when we are carrying our presents on our back. Il apporte des joujoux. That's right, il apporte des joujoux. And who are the presents for? Of course, it's for us. So we say at the end, et c'est pour nous. C'est pour nous, it's for us. Okay, are you ready to do the actions? Okay, we need to stand up for this one. So everybody up. Oh, let me move the camera so you can see my face. That's right. Okay, fantastic. Now, everybody remember, they're looking for Father Christmas. Is he there? Is he there? We don't know. Let's put the music on and we'll do it together. Okay, let's see if we can find it. It's à tu vu, à tu vu. Okay, it takes a little while sometimes. Ready, it goes like this. Ready, everybody? À tu vu. Le petit bonhomme, le petit bonhomme, as-tu vu, as-tu vu, le petit bonhomme au capuchon pointu, on l'appelle Père Noël, par la cheminée, par la cheminée, on l'appelle Père Noël, par la cheminée, il est entré, il apporte des joujoux, il y en a plein sa haute, il y en a plein sa haute, il apporte des joujoux, il y en a plein sa haute, et c'est pour nous. Good. <sighs> okay. I think we've done lots of Christmas words. I'm going to take my hat off. Or should I just leave it like that? That's nice. Well done. Okay. So I think we are ready to read a little story together. A kind of wintry story. It's in our books here. And it's a story, but it's also some information. Because in France, we celebrate Christmas a little differently. 
So first of all, we know that Christmas is called Noël. Noël, because we say Merry Christmas, we say Joyeux Noël. That's right, and if you turn in your books with your teacher to page five, it talks about winter celebrations, and we're going to talk about the first two, because that is Christmas and New Year. We celebrate New Year very much so in France too, just like we do here. But first of all, Noël. So Noël is celebrated both on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. So la veille de Noël is Christmas Eve and le jour de Noël is Christmas Day. Now at the bottom of the tree in France the children put their slippers under the tree on Christmas Eve to wait for Father Christmas to put the presents there. And so he knows which child has which pile. So he'll put um, our bonhomme de neige, he'll put his slippers under the tree and he'll put his presents on top of his slippers. Now, slippers in French, we can say the word chausson, chausson. You try, chausson. Well done. So that's right, so maybe you could try it. On Christmas Eve, you can put your slippers under the tree and see if you get any presents. <laughs> now for Christmas dinner, now this is very important. What do you have at home? Oh, I wonder. Maybe you have turkey, le dinde. Now turkey is very popular in France too, but also a common um, meat that, that they eat on Christmas Day is also goose. Goose, we say loi. You try loi. That's right. Our Christmas dinner can also be loi goose. Have you ever tried goose? Mmm, it's very tasty. And the last bit of information we're going to talk about is the pudding. Mmm, the best bit. What do you have for your Christmas pudding? Do you have Christmas pudding with the flame, mince pies, or ice cream? Or maybe in France, you would have la bouche de Noël, which is a chocolate sponge rolled and covered in chocolate icing. And it's the traditional Christmas dessert. Mmm, délicieux. Yes, that's right, so tasty. I love chocolate. Who doesn't like chocolate? Le chocolat. Very nice. There we go. So that's Christmas, Noel. But what about New Year? New Year's Eve is a very big celebration. And at midnight, à minuit, les amis and la famille, so friends and family, celebrate the New Year together by giving la bise, a kiss on the cheek, and in some places in France, they give lots of kisses. But this year will be a bit different because we have to be careful, don't we? We all know about washing hands and keeping space. So I think this year in France, it might be a little bit different as it will be here, but we can still have lots of fun with our family. So on Christmas Eve as well in France, they have lots of fireworks. Les feux d'artifice. And they celebrate um, at midnight, like we do, à minuit. And something that they would eat on New Year's Eve is oysters, les huîtres. Have you ever tried them? Mmm, very salty and sea-like. Foie gras, which is goose liver. And of course, the adults would drink la champagne. La champagne is champagne. It's a bubbly drink. Now the children in France, they have something which looks like champagne, but it's actually fizzy apple juice and it's very nice. There we go. So that's what we sell, how we celebrate in France. And I'd love to know how you celebrate too. Well, I'm going to leave you here, but you've been extremely good at listening to everything that we've done um, today. So we've learned some new words. Do you remember what they were? We had Un sapin de Noël, un sapin. We had this one, oh yummy. Des biscuits délicieux, des biscuits. And also, oh, 
our pretty candle. Une bougie. Une bougie. Voilà. Those are our three Christmas words. Now I'm going to wish you a very Merry Christmas. So you can wave and say, and say Joyeux Noël. Joyeux Noël, everybody. Maybe you could make a Christmas card together and, and give it to your family. And you'd need to write Joyeux Noël. Joyeux Noël, everybody. Have a wonderful Christmas and I'll see you next year. Au revoir.